Hey girl, hey, how are you? My name is Katie. This is Caption Fashion Katie Rural Lula Rural Boutique. Today, I am willing fall more than ever with my Halloween nails and my brand new Kennedy. I am here to talk to you about the Kennedy cardigan. So this is our raw edged mixed media cardigan. All right, that is because it does have multiple um, materials. Just to start right out, we have a two by two rib right here that is all along the edge. And then this is actually a brushed terry. Um, if you can see that though, see how it looks so fuzzy and soft? Yes, it's so fuzzy and soft. Well, it's not like overly fuzzy, but it's got that nice kind of like a Hachi. If you're familiar with LuLaRoe, you've been around for a while, then maybe you know what Hachi is. Um, so it does kind of remind me of that a little bit. Um, the inside is a little bit more smooth, but the out is feels like that Hachi and then right into these pockets too. Super, super soft. It's not a Hachi. It's a brush terry, but just to give you the idea, if you ever see anything I ever mentioned, something is brushed, um, it means it's soft, basically. Um, like our leggings are a brushed material. They're double brushed. That's what makes them so buttery soft. So this is a brushed terry material. So we have... In this sweater, oh my goodness, I cannot wait for it to be fall. Um, I don't know where you are and when you're watching this, but I'm filming this on September 1st and the high today where I live is supposed to be 103. But now more than ever do I want fall to be here. It is time to prepare. Cooler weather is coming. I know that because the Kennedy is here. So if you are familiar with LuLaRoe and you tried our Tracy Cocoon cardigan last year. Sorry, I have a, a stray hair. Um, our C Tracy Cocoon cardigan from last year. That one had the shorter sleeve, but it did have a little bit of that tightness. It had that dolman sleeve, but it was shorter. Um, and it didn't have pockets. She was super cute. I am 10 times more obsessed with this one. So it is a raw edge hem is what it's, um, if that's what this is. So it's got that very obvious like folded hem instead of this like being on the inside. It's on the outside. Um, it's super, it's super in look right now. And you could see it looks like a raw edge. Uh, super, super cute. Just that extra detail. She has the back yoke, which has something similar as well. And overall... I just, so good. I want to show you on this one. Um, if you can see that fuzziness and kind of see how it changes, it's mixed media. So that means it's like mixed fabrics and the way that it's, um, it's laid out. So we've got this fuzziness that I talked about. And then down here, it's the normal, it's the, like the smoother that is on the inside that I mentioned, the sleeve is kind of smoother but the top panel and that back yoke top is that fuzzy so then there's fuzzy on the inside here so wherever it's smooth on one side it's fuzzy on the other either way both of them are super super soft whether it's the fuzzier side the smoother side both super soft super super cozy really really cute i just i'm just so excited so we've got these giant pockets real big pockets here your phone is going to fit in there no problem it goes all the way to this back to this back um, seam right here on the side. So this is a nice big pocket. Like you can fit, you can fit a small child in there. Okay, probably not, but maybe a kitten. Um, so very big pocket, super comfy. It is kind of like a scoop like our Tracy was where it goes down and rounds out around the back and then super cute in the back. I really like the way it falls uh, on the body. Then we have a dolman sleeve, which basically means we have that big kind of that wideness right there, almost like a bat wing, that extra um, volume through there, which is super cute and in and just really makes me want to like cuddle up in this sweater. Now, I'm actually wearing a small. Uh, you're probably looking at this and you're like, oh, it looks a little small. It is a little small. Um, this is a small. It's definitely not my size. But this comes in four sizes. So small, medium, large, extra large. Great gifting opportunity, guys, because it's way easier to guess your friend's sizes when we only have four and it's an overlay like this. So I can fit into all four. Um, while I don't think that this looks horrible, especially maybe if I was wearing a shorter top, um, this was maybe like tucked in or something. That's actually pretty cute. Tucked in or something. Then this look isn't too bad. For me, the first vibe that I got off of this sweater was cute, intentionally kind of oversized look. So I really love the large. We're going to show you that. But um, 
this isn't bad either. Look, this fits me just fine. There is tightness through here. We have that exaggerated cuff with that two by two ribbing as well. So we have that nice exaggerated cuff that uh, really accentuates that wider sleeve up at the top. Super cute. Like I just love the way everything about this and how it falls. And I love the styling opportunities because like I said, with this shirt tucked in, or if this was like a shorter top that I'm wearing, I'm actually wearing a Daniela. Um, then this right here, super cute. And it's like a nice kind of overlay to me. I want it to be a nice oversized sweater. So I like sizing up, but this I've definitely seen, um, other pieces that are just like a kind of shawl almost that you could just throw on if you wanted to wear like a spaghetti strap, but you want something to cover. That's what kind of what this reminds me of. Super, super cute. Um, these all come in a, uh, Oh my goodness. In oh solids. All of them today. I like totally lost my train of thought. These all come in a solid today. So that's exciting. You're going to go with all these things. We have five great colors. We have now seen two. I showed you that gorgeous blue one. This lovely camel. Um, now I want to show you a medium. I love, love, love this oatmeal one. So cute. So now you can see it's starting to get a little bit more sweater like that one felt more shawl to me just because like i said i was sizing down on that one um this one is still technically a size down we haven't really talked about the size chart yet so i'll do that now because there are only four sizes our size chart is broken down a little bit differently so it's a zero six for a small i'm obviously about half of that now i could fit it and it wasn't too bad it even felt like it laid nicely sometimes with overlays i have that the problem with them falling way open because i have so much going on up here but i felt like that one laid very nicely for that um so zero six for a small that makes an eight to twelve 812, 8 to a 12 for a medium, a 14 to 18 for a large, and 20 to 26 for an extra large. Now, that being said, um, usually when our size chart is a 10, 12 for a medium, 14, 16 for a large, when it's a normal kind of size chart, um, I like a medium. And so I thought, well, medium is definitely going to be my size here, right? Kind of. This is now a medium that I'm wearing, and I will say I... I love this. This is like that perfect in between of how that small was fitting just a little bit tighter, almost shawl like to how the bigger ones fit, which is like more intentionally oversized sweater. So depending on the look you're going for, um, you can definitely play with the sizing here. This one is, like I said, 12. I'm technically like a 12, 14. I'm probably a solid 14 right now, guys. We've been saying it all year. I was going to go back down and I haven't. I'm probably a solid 14 right now, which would make large my size chart size. But that is typically true. And I also often like medium. So uh, I figured one of those two sizes. I really thought with our overlays, I typically like a medium, so I would like it, and I love this. I love, look at that sleeve, like the way it's falling when I'm talking to you with that big cuff, uh, and how it just falls through here, how it falls through down the back. Super, super cute. This one just covers the bum uh, because this one is more close to my actual size, and I think that this is that perfect compromise between that really lovely, like, shawl type that the small gave me and then that oversized feel for the large. So um, I thought medium would be my favorite. And I really actually think that it might be large. But again, um, today I'm feeling that it's the first of September here, guys. I am one of those that the first of September hits and you're like, oh my gosh, it's fall. I'm ready. Here we go. So I had all of the five fall vibes for this one that like big oversized sweater, denim and boots. You can't see my boots, but I'm wearing boots and everything. Um, so for me, when it came and uh, this is the look that I had in my head when I saw this sweater. Now, you can see this one is very much, um, this is a lot bigger. So this is all going to depend on how you want these things to fit. I had this look in my head. I expected it to be bigger, a little bit more oversized, like intentionally so, super kind of cute um, and laid back. And that's how what I feel this large gives me. Now a large, like I said, 14 to 18 for a large, I'm right on the bottom end of that large, top end of the medium. And I can definitely see how some days I'm going to really love the look of that medium. And some days I really want that oversized look with this large. So this 
fully covering of the bum. If you can tell, it goes com it goes well past the butt, and it is a little bit looser through here. It still has that lovely, the lovely way that it kind of falls through here with that cocoonness. Um, and again, and now I know I can wear three sizes because. I love that small, if that's the look I'm going for, especially if I'm wearing something a little bit um, like smaller through. Oh, my hanger's right here. Um, and I just want that kind of shawl feel. It's not totally shawl. It's definitely still sweater. But you understand what I'm saying? I've seen um, pieces like that. And then that medium is just that perfect bit of in between. That large is that oversized look that I was craving. And then now extra large. So extra large, of course I can wear. It's going to be much, much bigger if you really want that nice oversized. This isn't horrible to me either. I really love a dolman sleeve. I love this big bat wing that we have here. Some don't love the bat wing look. I love it. It's super in this season. Um, these pockets are even bigger. Like I think my dog could crawl in there. No, not really. He's huge. Um, but I love these big pockets. I could definitely fit like a bottle of wine in here though. <laughs> um, I'm looking around like what giant thing do I have that I could shove in here? I could probably shove a whole small one of those sweaters in here. So I love the big pockets. I love this as extra, extra comfy. Like I can't wait to like curl up in this on my couch and watch a scary movie because it's my time of year, y'all, when we could do that kind of thing. I also think summer is my time of year. So it just kind of depends on my mood. This is also though, also though super cute. So this one was remember a 22 size 26. I'm right around a 14. So this one is um, definitely sized up, but super cute depending again, how you want to style it, your preference, how you want these things to fit, the look you're going for. I could definitely see me with one in each size in my closet, depending on the look I'm going for. Sometimes I really just want that super oversized look. Sometimes my husband's a 3XL in men's and sometimes I like to wear his sweater because that's just the look I'm going for. Um, this gives me that same vibe, but definitely cuter and feminine where his is like a, just a plain old black zip up hoodie. There's nothing cute about. Um, this gives me that same kind of vibe. That's how I feel right now in this one, except this one's softer and much, much cuter. So um, the Kennedy today is 52. You've been wondering about my shirt all day. <laughs> have you? I don't know. Daniela, I think we have a Daniela video somewhere um, in here. If you've never seen one, I'm not going to go full into it because this is the Kennedy video. Um, it's our strappy back cami. We do have some of those today to show you with the Kennedy. If you need either style and you're not watching this on September 1st when I filmed it, you can always reach out or if you have any questions, let me know. Um, I just wanted to talk about this really quickly because you can see it's got a texture. If you, again, you're familiar with LuLaRoe, um, we seen this fabric before in our layers uh, back in the day. We had these layers in this material, kind of that waffle rib. It's called uh, pointelli rib or pointel rib. I don't know how to say it. Pointelli sounds better to me. So that's what we're going to call it. Um, so that is what the new Daniela's are. And I love these. I know we're saying goodbye to summer styles, but we still have brand new Daniela's because this is really a cute piece for layering underneath the sweater or any of our other types of things. It's a cami, so camis are always great for layering. So anyways, um, if you enjoyed this video, I would appreciate it if you gave it a little bit of love. Hit that heart button. There's a bell around here somewhere. I don't know where it is. There's a bell. You click it. You'll get notified whenever I do one of these videos. I try and do a video uh, for every new style that we get. So if you're curious, now you know. Hit me up on Facebook if you need anything. Capturing Fashion with Katie. I'm so excited about these sweaters and just willing fall even more. Look at I even have like, I'm ready for it, guys. I'm ready. In like three weeks, I'm going to switch back to tropical and then we're going to dive right back into that spooky fall vibes. I can't wait. Um, so I love it. Super excited to bring you this today. Uh, so many possibilities, great gifting um, possibilities as well because of that size range with only four sizes, so much easier, um, especially when this fit. Now, obviously, um, a, a true extra large in the style is not going to necessarily fit into the small. I'm right in the middle, which makes it easy for me to size up and down so many ways. But if you are 
on the bigger side, then you know that you probably could size down to a uh, smaller size, like a large instead of an extra large. If you wanted that fit or if you wanted it to be more relaxed, then you could. You know, it just gives you a little bit of an idea. If also, if you're a small, that small will be great on you, but you could also probably do a medium if you wanted a little bit more oversized. So um, I hope this was helpful. Subscribe to my channel. That's what I was getting at. I was trying to say goodbye, but I had to just keep talking because I'm so excited. So I will see you guys later on the next one.